What? I'm gonna be born again. I'm gonna be born. And think about today. We are gonna have an amazing conversation with women from our magazine. Women that were fearless, just like Karen, to follow their dreams, to make a difference. So I hope we all feel inspired in our conversation to truly take the leap of faith and create the renaissance in our lives. And what I love about being born again, for something to be born, something else gotta die. So the question is, today, we always have this empowering talk, but just for us to think like, what in our life needs to go? Gotta die. Maybe the fear gotta die. You know, the, I'm sorry, I can't, for, unforgiveness gotta die. Gotta be tonight. So think about the things that we need to let go in our lives so something amazing can be born. So we can be proud of the life that we create for ourselves. We cannot create an amazing, powerful life if we put ourselves down, if we think little. Being little doesn't mean humble. Littleness doesn't mean being humble. So that's what I love about these Renaissance women. The women that Heidi is going to invite to talk here, women like Karen, women of our lives, our moms, our grandmothers. <coughs> Sunday is a powerful moment for us to express our gratitude for the moms of our lives. These Renaissance women that were able to be born again. Like, of course, when I'm talking, come my grandmother, this woman that came from nothing. She came from a family, from the cycle of poverty, poverty, poverty. And then she was like, it's enough. This is not happening in my family anymore. I have three kids. And she used to sew dresses for brides. And I remember being a kid and... I believe my grandmother was the richest woman on earth because she had all these fabrics that I could play with. And my grandma said, it's enough. And she worked so hard that she put all her kids to colleges. And my mom today, she was so great. Like she found, which I'm not bragging, but it's one of the best private schools in the country. Like they represent Brazil in Harvard a few months ago through UN, like they are so involved in the community, they make a difference. And I saw my mom talking about my grandma, so when I see this Renaissance woman like my grandma, like they, they give us a legacy, and, and they invite us to do the same, that's what we are here for. So whoever is in the way that gotta die, let die today. That's what we are here for. And I hope you truly, truly use this opportunity to connect with women, to share